Hi Saj, um, this is going to be for you and the other person, Monday to Thursday, general read, sun, moon, and rising. So I think this is uh, September 4th to the 7th, okay? So let's see what's going on between you and the other person. In the uh, um, extended reading, we have more of the central issue and then also in their blockages, okay? So here we go, you and the other person for the Saj. This is you, sorry, this is you, <laughs> King of Pentacles, can be doing, dealing with another fire sign, or, well, this is you, um, maybe you finally, oh no, this is not King of Wands, this is King of Pentacles, sorry, <laughs> this is an earth sign, you probably have earth in your chart, or you're dealing with someone who can be, okay, one, they're stable, when it's stable over here, they're a person who basically only takes action when they are called for. Because that's stability. It shows. That's what I'm seeing here. A person who, okay, the world card can be a Capricorn, okay, as this is a Saturn um, energy. So something new is starting with this with this person that you're um, seeing or communicating, or it's about to begin. Because like I told you it's like the action, okay, which is the world card is about taking action. It's like a start of a new journey, okay. Let me see here. Um, you know, when you start off a new journey, it's not the whole like ooh juju journey it's like it's there is gonna be this week something is gonna move forward okay so if there was no communication it's gonna move forward that's that's a new journey okay let me see here and then you have your up oh, moving forward six of swords so definitely someone is moving forward an earth sign can be moving forward towards you saying yes okay like or oh, maybe you guys can start uh, talking already okay this is communication also let me see here okay the death card yep so something ended and something is beginning now very good energy here um for um for the sag because the scorpio energy here is about a quick a quick ending and a beginning you already have the beginning over here which is the world card so something fast is happening and then it's gonna move forward um when we get the the world card this energy is about um you know um starting a new cycle so when you start a new cycle with this person this can also show that um, in in essence, it's like probably things have stopped and then it's moving again, okay? Because something has to be dealt with first. The Six of Swords is dealing, you know, dealing with the Three of Swords, dealing with the Four of Swords, and then finally having the energy to move. It's like a ma minor arcana that is a, um, uh, you know, um, moving forward, okay? Not a chariot. Let me see this other person. The other person is Five of Pentacles, either... They feel left out. They feel that um, the world is not helping them. You know, it's like can be the person is not communicating because they need help. Five of Pentacles is not being, you know, like yes, it can be an energy where um, you know being left out in the cold, but it's in their energy. So they can probably have experiencing some trouble with themselves where they feel that you know like the things are not going the way that they are feeling as supposed to. And then you have here Seven of Wands. So their energy is about. You know, like um, they have a certain wall. They're being restrictive because probably they get it. They didn't get the cooperation that they wanted. But I don't think that this is yours because the ones, the seven of ones, this energy is about energy surrounding them. Okay, so things that have been happening, but this is not your energy. I don't see it. Okay, let me see here. Oh, look at that lover's card. So there is going to be some sort of connection with the Six of Swords. So you can be the one, the person, going towards the lovers, meaning the energy is going towards you or them, um, or they're dealing with you. They're going to deal with you because of the Seven of Wands also. Taking one step at a time, dealing with a situation one step at a time. I'm sorry if my puppies are growling. Let me see here. And then you have here, oh, yep. They're gonna move towards you, okay? So you can be connecting with a fire sign younger than you, um, Leo, Sag, or Aries, but this is a Sagittarian energy also, but you have here Capricorn energy also, a Gemini at the same time. But this person is gonna make a decision is very, very quick and very, very fast. Now let me see what's going on in the central issue. Central issue here is four of pentacles. Interesting, because you have four and five of pentacles over here. Um, so if it's crossing with the king of pentacles, you probably are the one more stable, meaning you're the one who knows how to make the correct judgment 
and the other person will just ga gain their confidence because you have here four and five this is very not confident card and this is a person who has um, who's very restrictive because they feel that they can't give and then the nine of pentacles both of them showing that um, you know like that this person is well you know if they're younger they need a lot of work for them to be um, confident and stable and more mature when the nine of pentacles comes when you're confident you are you know who you are so this person probably is left out because they don't know how or who they are yet so i'm going to continue this reading with more of the central issue and then also more of their blockages all right guys so thank you very much